Is Disco Nitro worth it? Is it something you should buy? Is this something which you should pursue to get? Well, that is the question for today's video. We've covered a lot of Disco Nitro on this channel previously, on how to get it for free, how to get it for life, and even hosting a two-year Disco Nitro giveaway at the moment to find out why people want Nitro. The link to that video is in the description if you haven't seen it yet. However, the question comes is that, is Disco Nitro actually worth it? For the average user of Discord, is it worth you going and spending your hard-earned money on something which is virtual? So that is something which I'm going to be giving my opinion on today. Today's video is completely my opinion. It's something which I believe in and it's something I'm going to be talking about from my own stance. I'm not promoted by Discord to say this and it's just how I feel about it. But before we do get into that, there's a couple of things that you guys need to do. Make sure to go and hit that subscribe button because according to my YouTube statistics, only 27% are subscribed. It's completely free and doesn't cost you a single penny. Also make sure to go and hit that like button and let's even get to a thousand likes in the first 48 hours. Comment some feedback, check out my editor's channel for today's video and join both of my Discord servers the links on screen. Get Customs Magical World to 10k because we're almost there. Also, I'm just going to go over to today's subscriber shout out as well. So let's go and get into that. Right guys, so today's subscriber shout out is MC Lounge. Now I'm going to get straight into the point where MC Lounge have literally made a custom name roll and I've currently got a giveaway going. So all you have to do is if you join with the link that's on screen and then you go over to self roll, click the little button down here you will be able to enter this giveaway for Nitro Classic. So make sure to go do that, check them out, and yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. Right, so before we get into my opinion, I should probably tell you guys what Discord Nitro is, first of all. I've done a whole video that explains it, so if you want it in more detail, make sure to go check that out. However, Discord Nitro is basically a pay subscription service, which allows the average Discord user to unlock perks to allow them to have better things. For example, it's broken down into two subscriptions, Discord Nitro Classic, which is the one which was released originally, and Discord Nitro Regular, which has gone through a lot of changes. I covered that in my Discord Nitro Explain video. However, the whole point of Discord Nitro is allowing the users of Discord to support Discord without Discord having to monetize the platform. It's something which Discord has said they don't want to do, and it's really something we should be grateful for, because we don't want those EA ads popping up. Oh look, you've access to paywall. You have to pay to access this. No. Discord Nitro is something which is just an add-on. It's something which you don't need as an average Discord user, and it's something I'm going to say at the beginning. If you're just an average Discord user that is not talking on Discord on a daily or a weekly basis, you don't really need Nitro. And the whole point of it is that it's there to give you perks in exchange for the support. So if you're not using Discord that much, you probably don't need it. But I'm going to break up my opinions into two sections. I'm going to break it up into classic and then I'm going to break it up into regular. And I'm going to talk about whether it's a scam really or if it's something which you should really go for. So let's go and get into that. So the question is, is that what does Discord Nitro Classic give you? Well, well, it gives you access to use emotes wherever you are. For example, I can go down here, send an emote from a server which isn't the one I'm in, and it can go through. And it can also be an animated emote. For example, like this one where it's a flashing GIF heart. It's something which anyone can use wherever they are on Discord and also animated. You can use it in DMs as well, for example. Another thing is you're allowed access to animated profile pictures. For example, the one that Ulsi has here. You also get a Discord Nitro badge on your profile and you get to customize your username by going into your user settings like this. All you do is go to user settings, you go to edit and you go here. And then you can change the full numbers you want. So generally, that's basically what Discord Nitro Classic does. It gives you bigger upload limits as well. However, that's about it. So for the average Discord user, the one that's not using Discord too often, you don't need Discord Nitro. And the reason why I'm saying that is that if you're not really using it on a daily basis, there's no point in buying yourself into a subscription for something. So you're going to be paying monthly or yearly, but if you're not using it that often, there's no point in going for it. There's only a few perks which enhance the Discord experience. It's not life-breaking or game-changing, but generally it is something cool to have. Like if you generally want to support Discord generally, then do it, buy Discord Nitro. But if you're just using it occasionally, there's no point. If you're using it a lot more frequently to talk to your friends, talk on servers, etc., etc., Discord Nitro Classic for the $5 a month or the $50 a year is something I would say that's probably worth it. And it's the one which I think is probably better value out of the two. Purely because of the fact that, well, Discord Nitro Classic is something which allows you to support Discord. You get a few cool perks like the emotes. It's something I use a lot and it's something which is really awesome. But you don't really need it unless you're actively on Discord a lot or you just want to support them generally. So the point is, is that is Discord Nitro Classic worth it? In my thoughts, yeah. It gives you enough perks to the point where it probably justifies the price. It gives you enough perks where it's just about the right amount, I would say. However, I think it's about there. 
For a lot of Discord users, it's something which a lot of people want to get. And obviously, with money being tight in the world at the moment, I understand that. And don't put Discord Nitro before other things. So your family, food, or your personal well-being. But if you do have a spare bit of money in your account and you are actively looking to help Discord out, then go do it and feel free to do it because it's a good idea. But if you're not, then it's probably something I wouldn't go for. Now, the next side of it is obviously Discord Nitro Regular. So I'm going to go over to Discord Nitro Regular and explain what that brings and also more about it. So Discord Nitro Regular is a higher price Discord Nitro. It costs $9.99 a month or $99.99 a year. So it's a lot more expensive. It is double the price. However, basically what it is, is that it's a bit different on this hand. For example, it does still give you the Discord Nitro badge, but you do have access to get this badge as well, which is the boosting badge. So basically the whole point is that Discord Nitro Regular is something where it allows you to boost servers. What I'm gonna say is that, yeah, it does give you all of the classic perks. It gives you HD video as well, I believe, and it also gives you better voice quality, etc., etc. But the whole purpose of Discord Nitro Regular is the boosting side of it. So unless you're really talking in big Discord servers, massive communities, don't go for Discord Nitro Regular is my take on it. Discord Nitro Classic probably suits you better. Discord Nitro Regular is only for people that are obviously really wanting to boost the servers that they talk on a lot and help them out get the better features. Now boosting is something which unlocks more features. As you can see here there's multiple levels, level 1, level 2, level 3 and that unlocks at different levels here so 2, 15 and 30. So each Nitro Regular subscription unlocks two boosts, you don't get any with Classic. So you could get level 1 for your server by getting Nitro Regular and obviously you can buy boosts as well. But the whole point of it is, unless you're really actively talking on a server or trying to grow your own server out there, then Nitro Classic is probably the better one to go for, in my opinion. Nitro Regular, on the other hand, obviously, if you're always trying to get your server out there, you're trying to support your server, is probably something I would go for more. I don't know if the extra $5 is worth this, really. I mean, in my opinion, would I? what would I do? Now, if I'm starting up a server, I would probably do it. If I'm trying to get my server out there, I would probably do it. But if I'm just an average Discord user and I'm trying to imagine myself like this, because I have never really been that, I've always owned servers, would I really need it? The point being that no, unless you're really supporting it or really supporting the server or trying to support Discord even more, you don't really need Nitro Regular. It doesn't really bring a whole lot more than Nitro Classic does, in my opinion. I mean, they're pretty cool. They, they both give a lot of perks. I think Nitro Classic's the better one to go for, in my opinion, unless you really want to support Discord. And again, this is completely my opinion. And obviously, it is supporting Discord. So it is giving you a lot. And it prevents Discord from, obviously, monetizing and putting ads across the platform, unlike other chat services, which is a good thing. So overall, Nitro, in my opinion, is worth it. I'd wor it is worth going for it. And... If you can try and get it for free in the ways I've told you, then so be it. Try and do that. Now, if you're obviously tight on money, you've got to be wary. Is it really the right thing for you to do? But overall, my opinion, Discord Nitro is worth it. The better value one, my opinion, is Nitro Classic. Overall, is it something you should get? Yes, considering all things, I would definitely get it if you're an active Discord user. If you're not using Discord that much, then no. That's completely my opinion on Discord Nitro. So, is Discord Nitro worth it? Yes, and I haven't been told to say this, um, it's completely my opinion, completely from my head and my thoughts. So I just want to be honest and I wanted to sit down and obviously I did a vote on Customs Magical World for what video to do and it's got 438 votes which is, you know, way above the next one down. So I do these votes on my Customs Magical World so make sure to join that. But I hope that really explains if Discord Nitro is worth it generally. So if you want to get it, go for it. But that is really it from me for today's video. And I know this video is a bit different from usual. It's a bit shorter, to be honest, I would say. It's not like the long, long videos I do. But, you know, it's something I thought I would say because a lot of people asked me for it and I did a vote and a lot of people wanted it. So here you are. Is Discord Nitro worth it? Yes, there's your answer. And that is all from me. So make sure to hit that subscribe button. Go and watch my other Nitro videos about how to get it for free if you can't afford it and obviously how to get it for life. And also go and enter the two-year Nitro giveaway as well which is on that other video it's basically an experiment to see why people actually want nitro anyways hit the like button go comment some feedback and have an awesome day i will see you on tuesday for the next video which would be awesome and thank you for 40,000 subscribers it is amazing have a great day and peace out